what's up everyone today i'm going to show you how to run google ads actually so and i'm also going to show you one of the best strategies that i use to run google ads so that you can get high conversion actually so if you are if you're new in this channel make sure that you subscribe and hit the bell icon so that whenever i release any new videos you might get, you must get notified actually so without wasting any time let's jump to the video all right so let's jump to the video right now so as you can see here if you wanna what do we call it um uh, run google ads firstly you have to come to the google and type google ads actually so when you come and type google ads actually um then as you can see i think i don't think you were able to see what what i what you're seeing on my side here it's because of i'm already having a google ads and i'm running ads actually so as you can see here you have to scroll down if you already have this you have to scroll down and come and click here then it will have to redirect you to this place actually so then what we're gonna do we have to say start now so right now here it's showing me all the accounts that i'm having so um what i have to do now i have to come to say new google ad account so as you can see here it has to show you this thing actually where it says add a new information create an account set a budget so normally what i usually do is i'm not ready to create a campaign for now because of we have to still what we call it register the google ad account before we even start to run any ad account so you have to come here and say skip skip campaign creation then as you can see here it will ask you know because of i'm in south africa then it has to ask the currency so if you're using if you want to use dollar you can come here and select us dollar or whatever the currency that you are in and also the time zone billing you know what we call it based on your country actually so i have to click continue yeah so now it has to redirect you here after when you create it so now you have to come here and click explore your account all right so as you can see here i think we are having a problem of the card issue so what happens is we will have to resolve this actually normally when when you are lending to to what do we call it to this place actually what you have to do is you have to come here and say uh billing setup and then you have to you will have to add what we call it um, example let me just come here where it says payment method uh, you have to come and add what we call it the payment method actually I think that declining because of there's no enough money inside of this uh, what do we call it payment method actually so you have to make sure that you have to what we call it to add the payment method before you even run anything so um, let's go back to that what do we call it to the dashboard actually so um what happens here is um what do we need to do actually why do we want to run google ads actually and first of all what is google ads actually uh the google ads actually is when you want to you want to be visible on google you know based on people what they're searching actually with your relevance of your business actually example if i want to search dentist right now in in, in where i am i can just say dentist in what do we call it near me so as you can see here uh, I will have to find what we call it people that are ranking number one page on 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 Google. It's just that where I am, nobody's running what do we call it. Um, nobody's running uh, ads, you know. Actually, so if I say dentist in uh, maybe Johannesburg, I'm just making an example. As you can see here, people are running sponsored ad, you know. Um, as you can see, people are running sponsored ad, sponsored ad, sponsored ad, sponsored ad. This is where people because of the relevancy of what i'm trying to search actually this is called google ads actually it, it's to make other is to make your business be visible on the google search actually so what are we gonna do now is um what do we call it what is our goal so um i'm going to market this business you know it's it's a, it's a construction business in in south africa so i need to bring more clients on their business based on what people are searching so normally they 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 specialize with uh repair blocks uh, concrete slabs and services um yeah i don't know the developer who have developed this website he didn't you know s scroll down the what do we call it whatever that the name of the, the company here yeah so 
um what i have to do right now is to put the, the what do we call it this campaign on um our main goal is to what do we call it when somebody clicks on the call call us at you know um a, a, what do we call it a, 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 it must hit as a goal so first of all we need to create a goal a goal is a conversion so on the google ads there's a place where it says conversion you know this is where we have to set up our goal if somebody clicks that if somebody search and find us and click that call button and then he call us for 60 seconds it must hit as a goal so we have to create that before we just jump to into running the ads actually so the, the conversion so what i have to do is it's going to ask us you know what kind of conversion we want to drive actually so as you can see here I will just say calls and then here it will say calls from the ads using call extension i think i'm gonna have another video specific into conversion actually how do you create conversion actually because the conversion you can create it over the google ads and also google analytics actually so i will make another video for this actually so now i will how I, 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 I will just click here where it says call from using call extension ads or ads then um I will have to come here and say call for uh, 15 second yeah 15 second then here I'll just say I don't use value here generally I don't come here and click what we call it and, and write how how much is worth actually so here this is the what do we call it uh, here say 15 seconds yeah I, I need to say 15 seconds if phone just ring for 15 seconds it might streak as if like it's a lead actually uh, i think it, it won't make sense right now but it will make sense while we are uh, continue to to do this actually so um and then again i need to what do we call it um uh sort of like if somebody click um a book book a call or if somebody click what do we call it um uh come and fill up this thing and then it has to trigger as yeah okay guys so which means um you're gonna be able to track what we call it if somebody goes visit to the website uh and click this button and make some call for 15 seconds that's what we're gonna have able to track actually and also if somebody clicks uh what do we call it if somebody fill up a form on the what do we call it a booking form on this website so which means it trigger as a date so i think it's good you're gonna be you're gonna have to understand the ones we are starting to run the campaign so now i'm going to run the campaign so i'll have to come and say new campaign so um here it says campaign your i mean choose your objective actually campaign objective so as you can see here it will say sales leads website app promotion awareness location and basic promotion um if you want to drive what do we call it a sales you know where you are selling you know things like phones you know you know like shoes like clothes something like that i generally you can use this one and also if you want to drive a lead and and their conversion by encouraging customers to take an action you can use this one and also there's this one where it says website traffic normally my strategy i don't use whatever what they're saying here because when i started it, it chose me a lot of money actually you know chose it means like it did it, it, what we i spend a lot of money a lot of money you know using this new i'm not saying that doesn't work but i generally use a create a campaign without goals guidance actually so here it's going to ask you here search performance display shopping videos app smart you know whatever this one it's a new one actually i'm gonna make a separate videos for performance max and also display shopping and all other you know platforms but for today we're gonna have search actually so we have to click you know search you know we want people who are searching straightforward so as you can see here this is where it's gonna select your conversion the one that i just created for call for 15 seconds here it is so now i'm gonna just go continue it's a goal you know it's google will tell us if somebody visit our website and 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 fill up a form or click whatever the call button it will trigger as what we call it as a conversion actually so now here it will ask you a website visit and also phone call 
so i'm gonna also make another campaign for phone call but here i'm gonna also do it so here because of i'm in south africa i will have to click south africa then i will have to come back to the website and then i will have to copy their what do we call it um there are cell phone number uh there's a way to put it actually as you can see here i will have to remove what we call it uh in, and put it in this way so the website i will have to the first thing that i'm going to create the campaign is for the concrete slabs actually so um i will have to say i will, I will have to copy the link that i need to target for uh concrete slabs um um then here i will have to name it whatever that i have to name it so now this one is for call concrete uh slips so i will have to say continue so here as you can see here it says conversion yes i need conversion so normally i just you know come and uh, leave it like this where it says conversion sometimes i do click sexually maximize clicks but now for now do sorry conversion sexually then I will have to click next. Then uh, here it will, uh, you know, ask you the networks. You know, there are some other website that Google is partner with actually. So generally, I just in, don't include a Google Display Network actually. I just only include Google Search Partners actually. But display ads where it will be displaying, I don't do that actually. So here, this is where a location. This is where uh, what do we call it. Um, sort of like uh where do you want to target in in you know in in uh, where do we where do we want people to see our ads so i will have to come here and say enter another location and then i'll have to target a location specific so these people they target by you know a location so number one is how they because of i'm in south africa uh so i'm targeting this whole housing and also even um uh, Limpopo actually this is a hole and um, Pumalanga if I'm not mistaken uh, if, it, if it's possible I will have to do uh, Ra, Rastenberg also uh, you can target whatever location that you wanna that you want to, to target actually then I will have to uh, I'm looking for this location. Yeah, I don't know how they spell it. Yeah, clap drop actually. Yeah, this is the place. Uh, let's see this one where it says what 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 what. You see how easy it is actually so I'm doing the, the targeting oh I think it's it's all porch oh yeah uh -huh. so uh, then I will have to save actually so if is there if you have another location that you don't want to include you can come here and say exclude actually like like example let's just say i don't want in eastern cape uh eastern cape people to see oh, sorry eastern cape uh, yeah eastern cape people to see my ad then i'll have to come and say exclude so here i don't usually this one of presence or interest people who are regularly in or or who have shown the interest in targeting location recommended i only use this one where present people regularly in this location you may find somebody was visiting in that location now they're no longer there but they can see your ads imagine it's a lot here on the languages yeah we can use english but normally i just see all the languages actually um what do we call it here? I don't touch normally. I don't do anything where it says oh, if you want to target using this one. I don't recommend this one. I think it works with the Google Display as um, so um, here the end date actually. So I think I will have to run this ads for um, until what do we call it? Let's just say until the tens. No yeah 
so this is where you start you know i recommend you to run these ads and manage here because of if you don't do that it's going to be really 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 high tier but so if you also want to learn about facebook ads you want to learn more about facebook ads i have a video on the description actually so which means you go and watch it you see how facebook ads work for beginners actually mm -hmm. um so here normally i don't touch on the uh ad mm -hmm. yeah so usually i don't touch you know this thing so now we have to click continue um you know this is where the key works. this is where the magic happens actually this is where you have to you know uh what do you call it uh put the keywords that you think your clients they might be searching if they want uh concrete slab actually you you, you get the point so um what i'm gonna have to do here is i have to rename this thing and write uh concrete slip you know so that i can know this is the group of concrete slip keywords actually so normally i don't run them like this because of um they are broad like this actually they are broad like this so normally I have to in, insert in inverted commas. I think I will, I will, I'm going to explain after when I'm done doing this actually. Alright guys, this is the way I put this inverted commas. It means that when I put this in, in inverted commas, it means that um, I want people to type anyway something like, I mean, if somebody type concrete slab, it must be like this, or it must be like uh, concrete slab near me, concrete slab close to me, you, you get a point. But if if I just, if I remove these inverted commas, you know, you might find people will come and call you and say hey i need concrete slab tools and you get up on we don't need something like that we need something where it's way much more specific all right okay this is the place where the final destination where um what we call it it has to be as you can see this is the final destination so here i would just say uh get free code yeah so um i would just say get a free code um this is the place where you can able to see how does the your ads going to looks like um this is the place where you have to add uh what do we call it the headers actually so uh this is the place where i also have to add the call you know uh you can add two different numbers if you want to add two different numbers but for now i'll just you know put my country here and also the number four nation. I have to come and go back and copy this number four so that whatever person clicks this number four and call, the Google must tell me that hey, uh, you got a call today, something like that. You know, so here I'm gonna trigger, I'm gonna trick that thing off the, the conversion that I just created where it says if somebody calls me for 15 seconds, it must trigger. You know, Google must tell me, you know yeah in case you are doing it for your clients you must tell them that hey you know i can see that you got the calls today you know some other you know clients they'll tell you that hey today i didn't get anything so as you can see here this is the what do we call it uh this is the the header so i'll just add top quality 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 you know to make it um all right let's just say um another one it will be resident i think you know if we are also uh vests um you need to get an idea through this or uh, what do we call it um through these headlines actually or you can go out and uh, concrete slab solutions uh, i think i'm gonna take this one it seems like best 
Okay, maybe top. Alright. Vest. Oh, sorry. Uh, until here, the add strength, it might say average or good. So, um, I will just say something that's related to concrete slab code. It's related. Because if you don't put something that is not related, <laughs> you're going to have a bit more blood, actually. Mm. Concrete slab installation, I think. Oh, yeah, concrete slab installation, I think this one might like it. Mm. I think I can. Okay. Um, I, I, I'll just type it out actually. Easy thing, I'll just type it out. Uh, Installation. Uh, Uncle Slap Foundation. See now, uh, I can just come and say top rated company, top rated company, call us today. Uh oh, oh, I think I didn't know. I lost two day. All right, let's just help. <clears throat> let's copy. Yeah, so this is what we are going to to do. Um, let me just yeah. So basically, guys, this is what. Okay, as you can see here, it says the strength is good. So here, this is what we have to write: concrete slab pumping. Uh, I think I need to remove this. You know, I need to. To come up with a description actually i think there's a description here where it says say goodbye to the crack surface i think i like it it, it comes with a pinpoint then let me just um uh what, 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 um, what do we call it let me come up with something um so let's show the benefit of the i need something that is related to, to yeah I think this thing is way better than like this. Uh, let me remove counting because of you're not targeting in counting only. Um, yeah, you have to come up with a unique, what do we call it? Unique, um, unique description actually. Yeah, 
So I'm gonna you do this one. Until it says yeah. Yeah, I think yeah it's a really good business name and logo. Side extension call out. I think for now I'll be just done. Um, you can add up the call extensions and everything for now this is how you create the ad account then I will have to do next so it says the recommendation it must be thousand on my side maybe on your side it can tell you something else but I'm gonna just say next and then it says weekly conversion maybe it will be converting you know uh, yeah converting actually 37 people will be filling up a form or clicking my buttons actually but sometimes it's not realistic actually yeah it's it's not really um realistic actually so um now i'm ready to publish the campaign actually so it says it cannot run as it's missing information you know so um all right let's just say publish i think it's because of the 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 issue of the what do we call it the issue of the cut payment actually that's why so um yeah guys this is it actually so if you like this video make sure that you comment or subscribe and hit the bell icon so that i can well, so that i can what do we call whenever i release any new videos like this you will get notified actually thank you for watching my video